Hey kids, how's everybody out there in YouTube land this afternoon or evening or morning or whatever it is, wherever it is time where you're at. I don't even know what time it is where I'm at right now. I just know it's laundry day. Don't do it, Lily. Don't jump in. <laughs> well, anyhow, hey Ian, what's up, man? Anyhow, we are here at uh, Marathon Marina, my new home. Right over here is the, uh, that's the shower and laundry building. I got my laundry in there uh, working away. This is a little garden here that they have uh, for the local cruisers. Can everybody can participate, plant something. Hey, Palm Limit, what's up? This is the, uh, the dockage. The Rosie's over there. You can probably see her about middle, right about in the middle of the screen. Right about there in the middle. Anyhow, so this is, uh, this is Marathon Marina. Anyhow, we're uh, waiting for our clothes in the dryer. So I thought it'd be a good idea to get on here and to, uh, to do a little bit of a live stream while I'm walking the dog. So, uh, tell you guys, it's been a, a day of running errands today. And uh, one thing I find in the dinghy, keeping my knees tucked up underneath of me, is kind of hard on the old knees, but it's all good. Anyhow, this is the service area here for them, uh, where the marina staff work on whatever they need to work on to fix their, sorry about the shaky camera work here, but to fix their stuff. Lily, get back here. Anyhow, this is uh, dockage here for some lucky folks who actually got to tie to a dock instead of being on a mooring ball. I don't know much privacy, but they do have convenience of a dock with power and water. This is the storage areas and a uh, little workshop here for uh, marina guests. You can, uh, you know, put a dinghy in there or work on a little project if you need a little clear, dry shop with power to work in. They give you a little workshop to work in. So, hey, John Dolan, how you doing? Oh, hey, folks, how you guys doing? Come on, let me get over here. They don't want you jumping on them. There you go. Anyhow, this is the other entrance to the little service work area you can see the little storage lockers here i think it's 40 dollars a month for a four foot by four foot storage locker man i'd love to be able to do that soon get a lot of stuff off my boat and give me a whole lot more room i have a ice maker here you can get ice for two dollars a bag uh, and uh, there's water here it's uh 25 cents i'm sorry it's five cents a gallon 25 cents for a five gallon jug so oh man anyhow i'm gonna go in here everyone's gonna look at me weird talking to my phone but i'm gonna go through so hey guys hope you don't mind but i'm live streaming while i'm coming through so just just do your thing so. huh? say hello that's sean over there he's, he's the boss man and this is the front desk where we come to for getting all the stuff that we need Hello. Anyhow, they have some beverages here, and they have a lending library and a mail area. That's where all of our mail comes to. And it's set up for Christmas. These tables over here are set up with Wi-Fi. And then there's a couple of television lounges if we want to go over there and sit and watch TV, which is kind of cool. Kind of cool. Pretty much got everything here that you might need as a uh, sailing cruiser. All your uh, needs are pretty much met. So then out on this side, we've got a little group barbecue area. Oh, got real bright out here. <clears throat> There's charcoal grills and stuff. There's a little recycling center here for recycling. So it's, uh, you know, it's pretty cool. It's a pretty cool dog. You're wrapping me up here. She's getting me all twisted up in her leash. So anyhow, little tour of the marina here. We come out to the very end of the point, and you'll see there's a little, oh, there's a portable toilet out here, there's a little seating area, a little private dock spot. Come on, Lily, dog, come through. There you go. Now, come back through my legs, so I'm not all twisted up. There we go. Anyhow, there's a little seating area and stuff out here, and a view of the boats. The view of the boats out in the marina, so. A pump out boat I see he just came in oh once a week you get 
once a week you get free uh, pump out. So, uh, getting some good lunch, Captain. No, I'm just uh, doing laundry, and I thought I would do a quick little live stream of the uh, of the marina facilities here. And Miss Lily, who's being a pain in the butt. Sit, sit, sit. That's better. Sit. Oh, ma'am. So we came over here to uh, do laundry and to uh, check in the main desk and to uh, uh, take a shower, which was nice. So yeah, it's a very nice place, Palm Limit. Really nice place. Nice facility here. Really nice folks. I, I had to kind of laugh. The, uh, <clears throat> the general consensus that I've been running into, um, uh, Lily did not go jogging this morning, but she did go for a boot scoot and boogie. Uh, and if you know me, you know what I mean by a boot scoot and boogie for Miss Lily. So she got to run around and have some fun and get some exercise today off the boat. So she got off leash and got to go run to her heart's content for a while, which made her pretty happy. <clears throat> Anyhow, uh, came in to do laundry and to take a shower and just to relax a little bit. Uh, ran some errands this morning. I had to go get fuel, so I took the dinghy over to get the gas cans filled. And then uh, I got on the cruiser's net um, yesterday and put it out there that I needed to have that uh, plate that goes through the deck uh, that I can connect to my uh, to the head that I'm going to install on the boat so that they can pump out the waste and uh, one guy said he had one and he wanted 20 bucks for it It was a used one and I made arrangements to go meet him yesterday and then in my zeal of cleaning up the boat getting ready to go meet him I <laughs> well I was going to run some errands take the trash out and provision and do all that stuff i was going to stop and see him on the way back and i re realized i forgot and threw out his uh the envelope that had his phone number on it uh, and his and his mooring location so i wasn't able to connect with him so i made a post hey gene how you doing buddy i'm feeling much better today gene thanks for asking uh anyhow so i made a post uh on uh the Buki harbor um facebook page uh trying to find hey chief has been how you doing trying to find the guy uh, so I could go pick that part up. And with that, another guy chimed in that he had a brand new one still inside the packaging from West Marina. He was just going to give me. He didn't want 20 bucks for it. He was just going to give it to me. So I motored over to visit with him. And if he's watching this, thank you very much. I appreciate it. Uh, so I got the, the deck uh, plate so I can install the septics. I, I think that was the last thing I needed to get this job done. So now it's just a matter of cutting a hole in the deck and getting it all glued up and installed and in place. So... <clears throat> I might be working on that tomorrow. That might be the job du jour tomorrow. So, uh, Captain Caveman, wow, I guess you did see that. No, I, I do not have an HDMI cable. Uh, I told him I don't have one, but if I come across one, I would get it for him. He said he already found one. It wasn't a big deal, so he just gave me the part. So, <clears throat> but, yeah, I guess you're on the Boot Key Harbor. Um, I guess there's a Coast Guard. Security warning going out. Anyhow, beautiful day down here. Uh, 78 is what it was when I left the boat. Probably up to about 80, 82 right now. Sun is shining. Uh, about a 7 to 8 mile an hour breeze blowing through the, the anchorage. Beautiful day. Absolutely couldn't ask for a beautiful, nicer day. Just beautiful. So, Captain Caveman is everywhere. I guess you are. I guess you are. So, uh... Did I miss anybody else? I say hello to Jared. I think I said hello, Jared. So, and Ian and John Dolan. Anyhow, so having a great day. Having a great, having a really great day. I'm waiting for my uh, clothes and the dryer to get done, and then Lily and I will head back to the boat, um, where I'm going to try to do some editing and stuff and work on that a little bit. But God, guys, look at this view I've got. I mean, there's my view. This is the view right here from from the marina here in uh, in Marathon. Now the Lily 2 is right there. I don't know if you can see her, but she's right there. So there's a, there's a catamaran and then there's a big uh, a cabin cruiser. Actually, I'm, I'm directly behind those two palm trees that you can see right there. Those two, I'm framed the center between those two palm trees right now. I'm right in the middle of those two palm trees. <laughs> Oh, man. Terrible to have such a bad view to deal with here, you know? 
terrible. So, hey, Kelly Banks, how you doing, man? Oh, dinghy's working out perfectly. The dinghy motor's working out perfectly. Um, at full speed, I, I, when I went to go get fuel today, I went to fuel, full speed. Even though I had a little bit of a current with me, I was still making five miles an hour at full speed with the dinghy, with just me on the board and uh, six gallons of, of gasoline. So uh, not too bad. I think that's, that's pretty good for my little 3.3 .3 horsepower. I think we did just fine. Lily, sit. Sit. I know, you're in the sun. I'm in the shade, you're in the sun, huh? Oh, well. You're fine. It's not hot here today, so you're all good. <clears throat> Anyhow, you can see some folks in dinghies coming and going. There's, there's a guy coming in, a little skiff. And there's another little one coming in. And you can see just about how fast everybody goes here. Um, this is a, a manatee area. Lots of manatees here, especially right here in front of the marina office. And so everybody goes very slowly so we don't hurt the manatees in the area. Uh, you'll see quite a few manatees here. So and dolphins. There's lots of dolphins in the in the uh, area here in the Anchorage. So it's pretty cool. But anywho, I just wanted to jump on and do a quick live stream, show you guys a little bit about uh, the marina here and what this place looks like. Uh, really nice facilities, nicely kept, nicely maintained. The mooring fields in great shape. The mooring balls are in great shape. Um, very very happy home. Very happy home spot for us. Me and Miss Lily could not be happier uh, with this location. So just about perfect for us, actually. So I'm pretty thrilled with it. So anyhow, with that said, uh, I'm going to go ahead and end this here. I did uh, get some fuel today for the generator. I did get some provisions yesterday. I've got everything I need, I believe, for the project tomorrow to get the head installed. So I'll meet that requirement here. Uh, got the boat registered. I'm waiting on some paperwork on the dinghy so I can get it registered. Apparently the, the bill of sale the guy gave me was insufficient here for the tax collector's office. They needed a bit more detail. So we're getting that organized. Uh, and I've already got my second uh, marketing piece out. Um, I've already done two mailers uh, getting my real estate business kicked into gear. So I'm, I'm pretty jazzed about that. I've been very busy. Uh, have you noticed I have not been doing my mo usual morning live streams just because I've been very busy in the mornings getting stuff done. So uh, getting a lot of stuff progress taken care of even though I've been ill. So I'm kind of happy about that. But uh, Carl, good to hear. Yep, yep, feeling better, Chief. Thanks. So anyhow, I'm going to go ahead and end this here. Uh, once again, I'll remind everybody, though, that uh, my PayPal link is in the description down below. Really need funds. I'm running into a lot of unexpected expenses right now absolutely depleted my funds i mean lily and i between us have less than 100 bucks right now again uh we've pretty much spent our blew our wad on all the things we had to take care of i think i'm okay for a couple of days but i've got some bills that i'm gonna have to have coming up here pretty soon notably the phone bill will be again and uh you know all that so if you can contribute that would be awesome we appreciate it uh and in the meantime we'll have more for you guys this evening at seven o'clock we'll see you then again be good be careful, take good care of each other, and I'll see you guys this evening. Good night, everybody, or afternoon, everybody. Bye.